<clears throat> okay, I am, I'm Leah with Backyard Homestead, and I was tagged by Sue from Little Beans Garden, and also by Calvin with Calvin's Corner 72, and the tag where you're supposed to name 30 random facts about yourself. So, here go my 30 random facts. Number one, I was born and raised in Mississippi, been here all my life. Number two, I went to a tiny little high school in rural Mississippi and I had a graduating class of 26 students. Number three, and this one's hard to believe, I was a cheerleader in high school. Okay. Number four, my parents were huge Bob Dylan fans and Bob Dylan's real name is Robert Zimmerman and my grandparents name, one was named Clifford and the other one was named Harold Earl. So if I had been born a boy, my name was going to be Clifford Earl Robert Zimmerman, and they were going to call me Zimmy for short. So thank goodness I was born a girl. Okay. Number five, I teach kindergarten, and this is my 19th year teaching. Number six, I have my master's degree in elementary education and I recertified for my National Board certification last year. So, woohoo, that's good for 10 years. I probably won't have to do that again. And this is number seven. I graduated from Mississippi State University, Hale State. Number eight, I will be eligible to retire in six years. I hope I can read all the key cards. Number nine, Alan and I enjoy going hiking. Here's my pack. Alan has a pack exactly like it. And my pack with everything I need to go camping. It has my hammock to sleep in, has my cook set, has some warm weather gear, everything to go camping. And my pack weighs 20 pounds. Okay. Number 10. Our dream is to one day hike the Appalachian Trail. We would like to through hike the Appalachian Trail after I retire. Number 11, we enjoy going biking. Here's my bike. Number 12, we get up at four o'clock every morning and we either walk for three miles, we hike with our pack pond for three miles, or we bike for nine miles. And y'all know I keep records of everything in a spreadsheet, so I write down the activity we did and how long we did it. And anyway, for the entire year last year, of those three things together, we did a total of 1,068 miles. Okay. Number 13, my favorite college team is MSU Bulldogs. Number 14, we have two cats. Their names are Mitz and Diesel. Number 15, Alan and I have been together for, for 23 years, and we will have our 10-year anniversary, um, our 10-year wedding anniversary, this summer in July. And we were married right out here in our backyard. The, um, that part of the garden wasn't here when we were married. It was basically a lawn and flower beds, and we had a swing over on the side, and we were married right in the middle of the yard out in front of the swing, so very special. Thing. Number 16, I like to crochet. Number 17, we have rescued and raised five squirrels. The first squirrel that we got, we um, after Hurricane Katrina came through, we were helping to clean up our neighbor's yard and we were out there moving sticks and raking and I found a tiny little pink hairless creature on the ground. So I brought it in and Googled it and tried to look it up and see what it was and it was a squirrel and it hadn't even opened her eyes yet and we bottle fed her and raised her into a full grown squirrel and she was really really attached to us and we were very attached to her. Turns out you're supposed to raise squirrels with another squirrel or a sibling squirrel or they do get really really attached to her. And I don't like to call her a pet because she's still a wild squirrel, but we raised her and we released her in this yard and we could come out and whistle and she would come running through the trees and she would jump down on the ground and climb up our leg and 
sit on our shoulder and um, we could feed her out of her hands. And she was she was really really special. But she didn't know about cars, and she got out in the road and was run over about about ten years ago. So that was pretty hard. But people found out that we raised a squirrel successfully, and then anytime they found squirrels, they brought them to us. So the next couple squirrels we got were um, a pair of boy siblings, and we named them Poncho and Lefty. And we raised them to where they were old enough to release, and they never really got attached to us like like Pi did. Um, they were more attached to each other because they had a sibling to bond with and play with. So we raised them, and we released them in our neighbor's backyard. And then later on, we had another pair that was brought to us, and we named them Buzz and Flip, and we raised them and released them in the backyard. So I guess a lot of my problem with squirrels eating our garden is our own fault because we raised half the squirrels in the neighborhood. We also raised a flying squirrel that someone brought us, and that was pretty fun. That was different. Let's see. Number 18, we have not had cable TV since the year 2010, and honestly haven't missed it. Number 19, we have two cars. We have a 1999 Buick LeSabre and a 1997 Toyota Corolla. And we intend to drive those cars. Let's see, the Buick has under 80,000 miles and the Toyota has under 120,000 miles. And we are going to ride them to the wheels come off because the, they're paid off. Um, the insurance is dirt cheap and the tag is dirt cheap. So we're going to ride them until they won't go anymore. Let's see. Number 20, I went on a motorcycle trip with my, on a motorcycle road trip with my dad probably about 12 years ago and we drove from here, went up through North Carolina, went to Maggie Valley, North Carolina. We rode on the tail of the dragon and then came back and we did, you know, other, other little side trips all through the mountains. So that was a really fun trip, a really cool motorcycle trip. Number 21. My very first vehicle was a 1962 Volkswagen Beetle that I helped to restore. So that was a real special car to me. And I drove it until it just wouldn't go anymore. Let's see. Number 22. <clears throat> I have a guitar. I don't know how to play it. We have a piano. I don't know how to play it. I don't know how to play any instruments, and I don't know how to sing. I can't sing a lick, but I love music. I love old Motown. I love good country music. I love rock music, pop music, all different types of music. <laughs> and I just broke the guitar. Okay. Let's see. Number 23. During the summer, I mow lawns with my brother, and um, on I wear a my Garmin Vivo Fit that tells me how many steps I take every day and how many miles I walk. And on a good day, when um, days when I mow, I can walk anywhere from 25 to 30 miles in one day. So that's pretty, pretty cool. Let's see. Number 24, I worked as a floral designer for five years, and I still go help out part-time at the flower shop on Valentine's Day, Mother's Day, or whenever they need me. Number 26, I enjoy reading books. I read a lot of different types of books. And I guess my favorite book that I've read is Atlas Shrugged. Okay, number 27. I enjoy cooking and baking. I love eating too. Number 28. My favorite color is turquoise. Number 29. I love, love, love chocolate. I really enjoy eating chocolate. And number 30, I believe that laughter and good homegrown food are the best medicines. And that is all the interesting facts, or not even interesting, those are 30 random facts about me. And, okay, and the last part of this is I'm supposed to tag five channels. And my five channels are The Passionate Gardener, let's see, Petals on Paving Slabs, Daybird Aviaries, Southern Ark Homestead, and Michael Horsford. Those are my tags, and all you have to do is tell 30 random facts about you. Have fun.